What's up guys, Dylan with the Wash Nerds, and today we're going to take a look at a very powerful local SEO tool. And I really think you guys should be using this whether or not you do your own SEO. This can be a great way to check that your SEO company that you're paying $1,500 a month is actually getting you the results that you're after. So let's jump right into it. You can see we have a generic search term typed into Google, just pressure washing near me. And then we're gonna hop down to this local three pack. So if you guys aren't familiar, this is basically Google's um, local business feature. So if you type in something with local intent, they're gonna always display the top three relevant businesses and the map. So you can see we're already ranked number one for this search term, but that's also not really saying anything because I'm currently searching from basically this pin location. So. They're not ever going to rank our biggest competitor, number one, over us when I'm literally searching from this pin location. Um, but say I wanted to check, see how I stack up maybe over here, away from kind of the big competition. Well, we can use a search tool called Local Falcon. So localfalcon.com. Uh, this is not a free website, but you can get a free trial. And I think they actually give you 100 credits, which we'll jump into that, what that actually means. But I'm going to go ahead and log in since I already have an account. If you don't, just create an account. And let's actually take a look at a scan that I've already run. So I'm going to go to scan reports and then open this top report. This is the most recent one that I've ran. So I searched or ran this scan report for the search term pressure washing. That's my business information. And then this is the map that it generates. So kind of across the service area, it's really cool because you get to see not only, you know, right where you're headquartered, but all across the city where you rank. So this number just represents where in that Google pack listing where you rank. And really, as long as you're within top three, that's good. Obviously it helps to be number one, but the search results aren't really that different for number one and number three. It's pretty evenly split at that point. But this is a great way to kind of get a before and after. So say I was gonna hire a local SEO company and pay them $1,500 a month, I would wanna run this tool and then hire them and maybe check in in three, four months to see if this actually improved whatsoever. If not, maybe find you a new SEO company. But if so, maybe they're one of the legit ones. So I'll go ahead and show you guys how to actually run one of these scans. I'm just gonna open up the run a scan bar and then it'll display this map kind of where your general city is located. And this is your main search term. So if you wanna change this to gutter cleaning, we can. And if you haven't already, it's going to ask you for your business information. So make sure this is displaying your accurate business name because that's what it's going to check the ranking for. And then this center dot is the center point for the search grid. So if I wanted to move this up, you can just click and drag that wherever. So probably try to get this to where you're covering the most populated areas with using the least amount of points. So each one of these points, it's going to run a search and give you that index of the top companies, but it's also going to take one credit per point. So if you're trying to really stretch those credits, I wouldn't suggest running more than a five by five. But if you do have a pro account, you can get crazy. You can do 15 by 15. And you can also change the distance between these dots. So say I wanted a little bit finer of a grid or I'm only really interested in this specific area, I can go all the way down to 0.1 miles just to show you what that looks like. It gets kind of ridiculous. I mean, I really wouldn't think to use this for pressure washing, but maybe if you're a local bakery and there's also a local bakery right next door and you're really fighting over that those couple streets, maybe. But after that, guys, you can pretty much just hit run scan. It'll take a minute to generate, but then it's going to kick out a report just like I showed you. So overall, we've used this already for kind of a before and after to show the results of some of our SEO efforts. 
and it's been a really good tool for us just to know that we're not crazy. SEO does take time, especially some of the uh, more advanced steps to really take time to show up, but a tool like this just makes it at least somewhat worth it so you can see the progress that you're generating. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys have any questions on this, I'd be happy to answer them down in the comments. But thanks for watching.